What's up everybody? Today we're going to be installing a 2 inch rough country lift kit on this 2004 Jeep Grand Cherokee. So as you can see here's the kit, it comes with these spacers here, new shocks, all the hardware and bushings that we will need. So hopefully this goes smoothly, uh, let's get started. Getting her off the ground. The top of the shock is either a 9 16 or a 14 will both work. And you just start taking it off. These are 10 mils on the bottom of the shock. There's two of them. So just take them off too. All right, now we gotta take these sway bar end links out. The stabilizer's here. So it's a 15 mil and an 18 mil. Let's bust them loose. All right, so this is the isolator right here. So you just get your little pry bar and you pull it down. All right, and this piece goes into here with the isolator back on it, and then you end up inserting your spring in here. So that's how it's gonna be set up. All right, now we lift the axle back up, and we're gonna put these right back in where the stabilizers go. You just cut the wire, have it extend up, and right in the hole. All right, so we got the spring and isolator and everything set up. We got the shock in, so that's what it pretty much looks like. You pretty much put the shock in the way you took it out. It's back together, the front is done. Now on to the back side. Turbo the steer just hanging out. It's doing his thing. Well, had to get some hay quick. Look at the happy steer. So the back is similar to the front. There's the shock and the spring. So it's just gonna be the same way that the front one was. So let's get this apart. Junk. Now we take this bolt out to separate here so we can end up dropping, dropping this down to put the, the spacer in. Okay, so we lifted the rear of the vehicle up and we're able to get this down and get the spring out. So now we have to remove this right here so we can install this piece on the bottom and reinstall the spring. All right, we have our spacer in. Time to go put the spring in. All right, now we jack up the other side so we can lower the other, get the other spring out on the other side of the vehicle. And there it is. Kind of a pain to get out, but just try to use a pry bar or a flathead screwdriver and pry these out. And you throw them right in the trash. Then this side goes in the same way as the other side. Step on it. There you go, and it's in. Now we're jacking the rear up so we could get the shocks and everything in and assembled. Okay, we put the shock in, we use the bottom bolt, then we're gonna cut this wire and send it up top and put the bolt in. Round two. Looking good. And there we have it. The two inch rough country lift is installed and looks pretty good. Thank you for watching.